any on reflection a point gained or a point lost on Saturday? Yeah, we need wins. You know, and we're looking for wins. If we're looking in isolation, the form of the of the home side, Plymouth, the way the game went, where you know we had the better chances, um, we're not disappointed with the way the, play, the players played and the result in isolation. But yeah, myself generally, I, I get frustrated with draws. I, I do get there better than losses, but um, you know, right at the moment. Um, somebody's going to win, and you know we we need the wins anyway to get into that top six, and that, they're the only things that's going to take us there. Whether that's um, you know a hard task or not on the individual day is is, is something else. But uh, yeah, frustration at the end of the game. Uh, it's a game we needed to win. You didn't have a lot of draws up to two weeks ago. Now you you've had two on the two on the trot. Yeah, very different types. Obviously, the the three all draw at Rochdale was totally different from Saturday, which was. You know, pretty much Saturday, two, two pretty good teams um, are playing against each other. But um, you know, each game is different. Uh, and, and as I said, for us, you know, we do need to go for the wins. That has to be that has to be the case. Uh, Saturday's um, performance and uh, result, anyway, keeps it there for us, and that's the most important thing. Uh, and we've got, you know, a, a, again another big week. It's great to be involved in these weeks where we, we go up to Bradford, then we, we, we host Charlton on Saturday. Uh, great games for us to be involved in towards the end of the season, and uh, I'm pleased to say everything to play for. Bradford City represents a, a kind of different challenge, and, and I would imagine the pitch is going to be a bit iffy of course and you know we understand that uh, it's you know much commented on the the, the the standard of their pitch but that does happen and uh, it's happened to you know several grounds ar around the um, uh, country whether that has an effect on the run they've had or not or their form I don't know but um, it was similar last year and they got through to the playoff final we're unlucky not to go up last year and and you know for whatever reason anyway they've you know, slightly fallen away uh, after being one of the favourites this year. Uh, really, anyway, it um, doesn't under you know undermine the size of the challenge. They'll be wanting to play well for their own reasons, as everybody does, and it's about us making sure that you know we get our form right, uh, sense the opportunity because again, it's a real big opportunity that we have, and and you know can be uh, um, a, a real key one in people's careers. When you're playing on a pitch like that, do you have to adapt different tactics, a different game plan? Yeah, slightly, but I don't think you should be too obsessed with it either. You know, players can tell and, you know, work out in terms of common sense the areas that they play in. And, and it's something that I won't be overemphasising anyway. Um, you, you, you've got to adapt and, and play what you see at that particular time. You know, we have, with, with all of our players fit, enough to, to, to I, I think, you know, cope with many different scenarios. And, and um, it's about just keeping those players fit and then making the right choices. As you say, Bradford City have fallen into a bit of an abyss. It, it's easy to do that, and we've somehow kept clear of that all the way through. Yeah, we've had key runs during the, the course of the season where we've you know, uh, um, kept ourselves in there, which has kept us sort of where we are now, just on the fringes of the promotion places, but all of the time, well within... Um, a really good call of getting promoted, and, and, and we're still there with four, four games to go. As I said, you know, with, with Bradford, you know, whatever their situation is, um, doesn't really uh, concern me or uh, um, involve me. I always look at side strengths. These have, you know, a considerable amount of strengths. They're, they're a very big club and some good players and a good manager, so we know that. But, but after that, it's about ourselves putting on our performance. You know, we want to be able to uh, compete and be very, very strong in this division. And, and if we get things right, we can. You're looking to freshen up tomorrow or same team? Yeah, no, we'll be looking to freshen up. Yeah, yeah.